So guys, uh, today I am going to tell you how to flash uh, new ROM uh, Xenon HD uh, which is based on Android 5.1.1 on our beloved MI3. So I have been testing this ROM since a few weeks and I found it is pretty cool and the battery is awesome and uh, I get about uh, a backup of about 3 days with a normal usage and if you are a gamer you will easily get a screen on time of about 6 to 7 hours and the battery will last for about one or one and a half day so I have already flashed it uh, let me show you so. so this is a ROM and uh, the team engine the Sanogen mod team engine is missing in this ROM so uh, you have to use layers and I have installed layers and I am using a theme known as uh, some midnight so you can see it is quite beautiful and it is butter smooth the battery is very good it is already rooted but uh, you have it is already rooted but you have to uh, install an updated version of super su and so you can see the android version is 5.1.1 and the name of the rom is xenon hd So let me go to recovery mode and flash it again. I'm using team win recovery so first of all we need to wipe so wipe delve cache cache data and system and make sure you make an android backup before flashing this ROM in case anything goes wrong you can easily come back so I've selected delve, delve cache cache data and system just go ahead and wipe it. I have already made an Android backup of my ROM. So here you go back home install. Yeah, there it is. It's in on HD. Sorry. Uh, I'm also going to flash a kernel that uh, is pretty good and I, I will attach the kernel also and if anyone wants to flash the kernel also uh, you can flash it it's good yeah its name is phantom kernel caches and okay. the last thing installing gapps
Okay, so we are done now. Just wipe the caches once again and reboot. So the first boot will take a bit of time. Please be patient. Don't switch off or reboot your mobile. The boot animation is pretty cool. And please note that uh, uh, there is only one bug in this ROM that is the camera bug which is present in all the ROMs and that is just in HDR mode. Otherwise, this ROM is perfect without any bugs. And I have been using it since a month or so. Finally, it has booted up. Let us set up it. Sorry for the call. Final setup. No, no. And 
here we go so we are good to go the ROM is pretty smooth the battery backup is very good and the launcher is not so good so please go ahead and install Nova launcher and it will be very beautiful so as usual thanks for watching have a nice day